They ought to make the day the time changes, the first day of summer. What? Well, it's 8 o'clock and it's still light. A lot of good the extra daylight does us. Now, we've still got a three-hour drive back. We're not going to be home until after midnight. Well, if it really bugged you, Johnny, you wouldn't do it. <laughs> you think I want to blow Sunday on a scene like this? You know, I figure we're either going to have to move Mother out here or move the grave into Pittsburgh. Mother wants to remember, so we trot 200 miles into the country and she stays at home. Well, we're here, John, all right? Ladies and hey, gentlemen, good. we're coming back on the air after an interruption due to technical problems. station. Which row is it in? Well, there's no one around. Well, it's late. You'd gotten up earlier. Oh, look, I already lost an hour's sleep on the time change. I think you'll complain just to hear yourself talk. There it is. Come on, Barb. Church was this morning, huh? Hey, I mean, praying's for church, huh? Come on. I haven't seen you in church lately. <laughs> well, there's not much sense in my going to church. Do you remember one time when we were small, we were out here? Well, you used to really be scared here. Johnny. You're still afraid. Stop it now. I mean it. They're coming to get you, Barbara. Stop it. You're ignorant. They're coming for you, Barbara. Stop it. You're acting like a child. Look, they're coming for you. Look, there comes one of them now. He'll hear you. Here he comes now. I'm getting out of here. Johnny. Thank you. 